a worker was paid 300 times his salary due to a payroll error. 300 times. That's how much a typical CEO is paid over a typical worker's salary. The worker was a dispatch assistant at a cold meats factory in Chile. His average salary equated to 550 a month. But when he got paid, he was paid around $180,000. So really that's more on the order of 330 times his salary. Now considering that the average salary in Chile is 750 a month, that means that the worker was already getting paid a lot less than the average. So initially, the worker notified management of the error. So the manager goes to HR and HR turns around and tells him, pull the money out of the bank and give it back to us. So the worker agreed initially. Then after giving it some thought, he decided it would be better to just withdraw the money and get out of Dodge. So over the next three days, the company did whatever they could to get a hold of him, but to no avail. Now at this point, the man did what any man who comes across such a huge unexpected windfall would do, quit his job and get a lawyer. What did the attorney do? Submitted a letter of resignation on the worker's behalf to the company. So at this point, company reps went ahead and filed the complaint with law enforcement for misappropriation of funds. Now I'm no lawyer, but was it him misappropriating the funds or was it somebody at the company? Maybe his name was similar to that of the CEOs and by that maybe they got the checks mixed up. Would that mean that the CEO then got a check for 450? So at the time of this taping of the video, he has not been found. Doing the math, less attorney's fees, the worker made off with 27.5 years of his salary. I'm not advocating for that. If it happened to me, I would return it. Who wants to be on the run, much less losing nights of sleep, both for conscious purposes and simply just fear of getting caught. Still, one has to wonder if he was living a really hard life, probably working many more hours a week than we do say here in the States, with questionable work conditions at best, what would go through your mind? With it being such a rare occurrence, he probably saw it as a window of opportunity closing. And if he were totally trapped in poverty, that may have spelled his one way out of that for him and his family. It's really hard to know for sure, but I definitely encourage you to like and subscribe, hop in the comments, share your thoughts on it. Have you ever been in a situation like that? What did you do? What if it were $160 billion? Thanks for watching.